Hey, mind if I get your name and badge number? It's been on the video the whole time. What was that? It's been on the video the whole time. You can read off the video, right? Actually, not really. Hey, what's, what's with the attitude, bro? So I'm giving you all the transparency. We're doing the cop watch in Bakersfield, California. That's right. Nothing I can do about it. That's right. I don't care if you guys film, just stay right there. Sound good? Yes? How about you stay right there? Oh. I don't have to, right? Correct? <laughs> the only thing I will say, and I totally respect what you guys are doing, I totally understand it. The only thing I, I would throw out there is that there's people, because I heard one of you guys got into it. Well, you didn't get into no, it. No, that guy got patients. into it with them. Correct. He got into it with them, not us. Because a lot of those people in there do have some mental health the guy issues. Said, the guy yelled and said that he's been waiting in there for a long time. He says, take me back already. He was that mad at them, not at us. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, that they tried to do to us, man. In reality, it, the, way, the way things are, and this is why we have to do this, man, because the corruption boils in places like this, dude. The recipe for, for corruption, dude. It lives. It lives and it grows. What's your YouTube channel, Bill? San Joaquin. Have you heard it? I know. I've seen it. I'm one of the smaller channels. No, you're actually one of the bigger ones. Thanks, What I was saying, what I was saying was, you know the people in there actually have a lot of mental health issues. Yeah, I know. So if, if I'm sitting in there and you come in with a camera, I'm like, hey, man, what's going on? Check this morning. But wait, wait. These people, that they don't see that because they have schizophrenia. It would bipolar. All these it would amaze you to see how many people actually appreciate when we go to these places: probation, mental health, welfare. All that. Okay. Oh no, I, I feel you on that. But what happens when you go in there with a camera and, and you encounter a guy that has those mental health issues? Because we diffuse him like that. His ego's hurt. What's that? Yeah, it is, dude. If you're all so, on yeah, What's the little holder you got? Does it zoom and stuff like that? Shh, you're interrupting my narration, sir, please. I'm interrupting. As right? I was saying, um, it looks like they're taking them out of the vehicle. Please don't interrupt me. I'm narrating. Thank you. Have a nice day. Police officers have a code of ethics that they're supposed to abide by. In their basic course instructor unit guide, there are examples and potential ramifications of unethical or unprofessional conduct. On page 25, Roman numeral 8, letter C, it states, Although the law enforcement code of ethics and code of professional conduct and responsibilities for peace officers are positive documents, it is essential to identify specific acts which are unethical or inappropriate. When we, the complainant, make a complaint on an officer, we need to make sure we specify what it is exactly wrong that the officer did. We need to be able to point out and articulate what unethical and professional code they violated. In this case with this young officer, he violated the first example out of 11 given, verbal abuse, discourtesy, and or inappropriate language.
This means that by the actions of this officer, the indiscretion severely damages the credibility of the officer and the agency that he works for and also compromises public trust and support. Yeah, well, we're good. We've got a couple tough guys here. A couple tough guys? <laughs> You're so funny. How you doing, buddy? Good. You work here? No. Oh, shit. Your dad says otherwise. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Um, what kind of services do you provide here? You know, I really don't uh, appreciate being filmed. What's your name? Julian. Julian? Yeah. Um, you work for the public, right? Uh, no, this is HR. Huh? This is HR. HR. Um, do you not work for the County of Santa Clara? Oh, yes. Okay, so you work for the public. Um, just general questions for the okay, well, um, public. I'm just a receptionist. Can I get you someone who would be able to answer your questions? Um, I just want to know what this office is and what you guys do here for the public. Uh, that's it, we're done. Yeah, I can get you someone to talk to. Oh, you don't know? Oh, well, right now, I'm not exactly sure like what uh, kind of information you'd want to know. So I'd like to we get you the best possible you. information you yeah, can Yeah, we get. just told you what this office does for the public, for general information for the public. Okay. But yeah, you can go get somebody if you don't know how to answer. Sure. One second, please. Thank you have a question? Yeah. Just, uh, you have a list of like the tax rates? All the tax rates are different in every neighborhood. There's actually a 180 page book that huh? you get on the second floor. Get on the second floor? Mm -hmm. Cool. Well, uh, can I have your name? My name is Greg. Greg? Mm -hmm. uh, last name? McFadden. McFadden. Thank you, sir. Have a wonderful day. What are you guys doing with all the cameras? I saw you guys outside yesterday, too. Yeah, I'm just going to record and get information for the general public. Okay. Informa informative, you know? I try to educate myself and educate you guys everybody. Like uh, aspiring. <laughs> <laughs> I'm one of the managers. I'm not Concerned really the business manager. manager. I'm, I'm like the head of the yeah, IT group. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. With the public, okay. Yeah. So are you representing yourself or someone in particular? Americans of the United States. Okay. I represent. You guys ever heard of San Joaquin Valley Transparency? Yes. Yeah, that's what's up. Say hello. hello. Okay, so subscribe to San Joaquin. <laughs> Subscribe to Sam Joaquin. Yeah, all right, what's up? This month? This month? That's what's up. Good right shit. <laughs> it's called a cam back. Uh -uh. Don't you have body cam? I do. Is it on? Yep. Can I have your name and badge number? For what reason? So I can uh, request that picture you took. Why do you have to request that picture? You're in a public place. That's right. I'm allowed to take pictures, right? It's like you yeah, but the difference is, man, uh, you're on duty and I'm not. So, you want to do shit like that, then I'll request it. What's your name and badge number, sir, please? You're not duty. Your name is right there. What is that? Brian Ray. It, what is it? Colonel Police Department. ID number 1296. 1296. All right, thank you. Very well. Please don't invade my personal space. I'm not invading any personal space. I'm standing on public sidewalk. Right, you stepped into him. Yeah. No, I couldn't hear him. There's no need for intimidation tactics, man. No intimidation whatsoever. Sure there is. is You're there trying. Anything? You stepped into him. You you hear perfectly. What's that? Yeah. You you go back to acting 101. You know, verbal judo isn't gonna win. We don't use verbal judo. You what use real judo. Real judo. Well, verbal judo is not a longer term. Uh huh. Okay. Well, you take that walk of shame. back to us so this is how they act you know when you address the public it's uh customary to identify yourself you know and it's also your policy, is it my policy? yeah it is what policy, it's the policy to learn it and to know it did they give you guys permission to search that vehicle They searched that vehicle. Looks like they they ID'd everyone in the vehicle, searched the vehicle. Remember in the future when now you're they're searching with the trunk, check it out. Street and public photography is legal. You shouldn't be upset with it, officer. Yep.
I had a building manager tell me she's not afraid of the camera because she's got nothing to hide. Yep. This guy was angry for some unknown reason. All right, did you gentlemen have any further questions? No? He left okay. his ass standing there. I walked away from him when he started asking me. Ha. <laughs> yeah, buddy. the police state pretty oh. much you know we go out and record and make sure they don't violate people's rights and shit like that oh that they don't bother people yeah wow like that's that. pretty good yeah man do you ever watch youtube which, which one is it do you ever watch youtube yeah yeah here man that's you guys that's us oh, okay my car. watch what we do i think that's necessary yeah keep definitely. everybody even you know keep everybody, everybody uh, has accountable to be accounted for that's right man and no one's above the law that's right, man. Thank you for that. I know. That's so I think it's a good job what you guys are doing. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I'm all for it. Hey, can you say uh, subscribe to San Joaquin Valley Transparency? Yes. Subscribe to San Joaquin Transparency. Yeah. Transparency. San Joaquin. San Joaquin. Valley. Valley. Transparency. Transparency. Thank you, man. Absolutely. That's my channel. You guys are Enjoy, doing a good man. job. Enjoy. Thank okay. you. Thank you. I appreciate you, man. That's right. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Have a good one. How you doing, man? Hey, you mind if I get your name and badge number? You've been on the video the whole time. What was that? You've been on the video the whole time. You can read off the video, right? Actually, not really. Okay. Hey, what's, what's with the attitude, bro? Yeah, yeah, you do. You have an attitude, man. Turn on your lights so you don't cause an accident. Now you're yawning. Yeah, right. 